Welcome back. Laurentius should be on his way back to Fort Dongard, which means that we are free to go do some vampire hunting. We have to go, well, a good chunk of the way back across Skyrim in order to do that, because we are currently here, and we need to go probably along this way, if we can finagle it, all the way over here. But before we do that, we really should go ahead and huh? level up. I'm going to do that right here. And I'm actually going to raise our Magicka because there are a number of perks that I would like to get that require us to raise magic skills that, to be honest, we've been ignoring. So we need to be casting these spells, and extra magicka will be very helpful with that. And now, to spend the two perk points that we currently have, let's head over to lockpicking. There is a perk that I feel like we should have taken some time ago called the Game of Fate. It makes it so there are five Dragons of Fate hidden in random locked containers in Skyrim. Each one grants 15,000 gold. That is an obscene amount of gold. And a free perk point when it is removed from its container. So, we find one of these, we get back our perk point and 15,000 gold. When we find the other four, now granted we will have to find them and they're scattered around Skyrim, so it'll take a while. But, when we find the other four, we'll have gotten four free perk points and 60,000 gold that we wouldn't have gotten otherwise. How broken is that? This perk is just amazing. I'm going to take it. And taking it now still works out pretty well because I feel like we've barely scratched the surface of exploring Skyrim. Let's also go over here to Archery. And I am going to go ahead and buy Wing Strike. It will enable us to possibly stagger enemies when they get too close and we bash them with our bow. And then we can deal extra damage to the enemy we just staggered for 10 seconds. Having purchased Wing Strike, we can buy Clean Kill next time, which will open up Arrow to the Knee and some other really, really, really great perks that I absolutely would love to have. So we have a good foundation for archery. I'm definitely going to get Thread the Needle once I'm able to. It'll just be really, really nice. What the? You're the one who walked into me, dude. What's up with that? So now, we really should be heading off to Hamar Shame, but there is that cave over there that is just kind of taunting me, I feel like. So let's actually head over there. Wait, I want to save first. And just kind of check it out, you know? It's a good place to explore, I guess, I hope. Tolvald Cave. Alright. Now before we go in, I want to cast some spells. Let's not look at everything. Let's go ahead and cast... Stone flesh could be really useful. There's a cave. I will worry not. 
And I think Muffle is probably a good idea. Alteration and Illusion are two of those magic skills I was talking about, where I want to be able to buy some perks that require us to raise our skill. I'm going to switch to... How about the crossbow? And sneak. Right, so we are sneaking, and we have a torch. This will go swimmingly. It looks like there's an ore vein over here. Let's see. It is an iron ore vein. Maybe we can catch it a little bit later. There's also this campsite. And... I'm not sure what's up with that sound. There's a chest, and I just lost my stone flesh. Okay, let's see if we can unlock this chest. I was going to say, well, that was easy. <laughs> nope, not quite. Oops. I was a little bit too cocky. There we go. I had to really move it over. Okay, um, I'll just go ahead and take all of that. And what is that sound? Is there, is this a journal? Read Hunter's Journal. After trailing the beasts for several days, I think we've finally found their lair. It seems like their den is further in this cave. There may be more of them than we first thought, but after seeing the strange columns and pipes, there may be some sort of ruin here. My gran always said those places were full of treasures, just waiting for the first person to find them. We've decided to make camp and try to clear out the animals and see if there's anything worth taking. Hmm. There could be treasure in this cave. That sounds nice. I wonder if there's anything else interesting in this camp. I'm still very disturbed by those sounds. Ah. Um, I'm not sure that went all that well. Alright, I'm not gonna waste my time with this. I'll go ahead and use the sword, and... How about my shield? And I can guard. Or at least I can try and fail the guard. Well, for a second there, I thought I'd switch to third person. Okay, great. Where? Here's the ice, right? Pile. Okay. So, yeah. Nothing over here. I'll be optimistic and switch back to the crossbow, but first... Uh, I still got muffled for a little bit. Iron door. Can you come with your- oh wait, there's another- Ooh, there's a silver ore vein too. Alright, forget about Muffle. Okay, I decided to just go ahead and mine both of those ore veins. So now, let's recast our spells. I'll just do Muffle for now. Oh, it looks like I could also maybe do stone flesh. Do I have enough mana for that? Just enough. Oh my goodness. Okay. So let's crossbow. I wandered Skyrim for years until I was taken in by a priest of Mara who lived in Morthal. Um, and then let's walk directly into a dead end. Ow! Oh, 
Uh huh. All right, look out for bear traps. That was amusing. And I see there are these columns and things. It looks like they set up some kind of a noise trap here. I wonder if the hunters did that. I wonder, can I just like jump over this? Alright, of course, he knocked it down but didn't make any noise. Hmm. And it looks like there's another ice wraith. Can I snipe that? I wonder. Nice! I do concentrate on Arondor. And I will concentrate on you. You have to like hit the head and it moves funny. I'm wasting all of my bullets. Alright, or it can just do that. Haha. <laughs> okay. Continuing on. Uh -huh -huh -huh. None of this bodes particularly well. I feel like there's another one of those. Yeah, it's probably right on the other side of this wall here. Ha! Ah, got it! So, I wonder if we can see the ice ray. Oh, alright. You know what? I'm switching to my sword. Yeah! Oh, I should stand up. We've learned that sneaking and melee combat. Sorry, sorry, do not go well together. And neither does hitting our friends go well with anything, really. I mean, unless, you know, you just feel like backstabbing someone. Not really a fan of that. Okay, so now that everybody knows we're here, I'm not sure it's a good idea to do Muffle again. Maybe I will conjure a flame at you now. Oh, I except like that I don't have any. Place. Not at all. You don't like the looks of this place. Well, I mean, there is lots of blood and oops, skeletons and ice wraiths. That doesn't bode terribly well, but I think we'll be okay. We're gonna have a play match and knock on our side, and there's treasure. Treasure is definitely, hands down, a very good thing. I've done a lot of questionable things in my life. Serving Vermina was a horrible mistake. I hope Mara will forgive me one day. Okay. Sorry, I just am compulsively looting. Let's see, you know what, maybe I should have that out. What's through this door? Ooh. It's wonderful to be able to sleep soundly, don't you think? Now check that out. That is really cool looking. And of course there is more blood here. Alright. Now this, I mean, 
come on. There is no way this could possibly be trapped. I say as I catch I've sight of the trap. I've been journey with you. Not for the wealth we've accumulated, but just being able to carry Mara's will to every corner of Skyrim. Why, thank you. You know, I've been enjoying our journey, too. But I'm not sure we've quite reached every corner of Skyrim. Gold ore. Nice. Magica. Okay. Coin purse. Sweet. I Let's don't know see. what persuaded you to assist me when we met in Dawnstar, but I'm glad you did. Let's see what's in the chest. A barbarian hero circlet. Okay. Gold and more magica. I'm going to take this stuff and then I'm going to back away really quickly. Whew. Oh man, that would have been really bad. Oh, wait. I've been poisoned. This is not good. Oh, do I have my healing up? Because this is getting really bad. Okay. Um, I'll take the risk. I'll try fast healing. Oh, thank goodness I got that healing in. I need to take potions. Alright. This is not going very well. Potion of healing sounds good. I don't want to take too many of those. I'll take plenty full healing, some minor healing. Okay! Um, wow. Not, uh, oh no, I'm getting really low again. Wow, these guys are tough. Okay. More plentiful healing. A bunch of minor healing, because I have a ton of those. And, um... Let's see. I... I'm gonna pull out my Dwarven Buckler. Actually, before I do that, I think maybe I should go here and add him up. Alright, so now I'll take another potion. For, like, five. And I will pull up my buckler. That should protect me. Out of our gun. Oh, Arendor isn't doing that well either. Oh, gosh. Dwemer gear. I'm not sure that's worth it. Ectoplasm is, though. How are you, Arendor? You know what? We both could use some healing after that. I'll heal you first because I'm feeling generous. I hope you're not expecting a thank you. Nope. The restoration skill increase is good enough for me. Finding Mara was the greatest moment of my life. I'll never forget the warmth that spread through my heart when we embraced. Did it feel something like what I'm doing now? I think you're probably okay. Now I just need to take care of myself. And you know what? Let's assess. We got the treasure. It was trapped. We barely survived getting attacked by these Falmer. I am thinking I am not really in much of a rush to explore this place any further. Now, are there... I wish there were a way to close these openings. Well, I can pull this. Okay, great. So that's closed off. I've never admitted this before. But I've killed more than I care to admit. I'll just leave it at that. Okay, so here's the deal. You don't backstab me, and I will not judge you for that. Let's get out of here. Okay. So we survived the Falmer attack. We escaped from the cave. 
I'm almost kind of wishing I'd grabbed a couple of those bones so I could like put an X here. Like, do not go in there. Oh my goodness. But since I can't, we still need to get across to Hammer Shame. I'm thinking, let's go ahead and... Actually, not fast travel. Let's see if we can get... There's this ridge here. We might have to do some funny business to get past. But let's actually try going along here to get over. Riding Julie. Following this kind of not really a path, I guess. And heading westward. And of course, we're gonna go right past the bear that's not gonna be happy about us. And we end up going down here. Dark clouds and thunder threaten the path ahead. Oh dear. Alright. Well, at least I'm wearing my uh, rain cloak and not, say, the fur cloak. And, um, no, I don't want to go over there. Where are we going? We are going someplace very strange and random. And don't kill my horse. Don't kill my horse. Don't kill my horse. How I'm gonna kill my horse. Stop doing that! Oh my goodness. Okay. So now that we are not killing our horse, let's continue. Can I just go straight across here? I could, but I think I actually want to go back up this way. So let's, let's continue this way. Nothing. Absolutely nothing. No, there's no game. There's no game. Maybe a game of hide and seek. <laughs> and I'm running away. <laughs> oh dear. Oh dear, oh dear. I love, though, having my light armor randomly increase without me having to do anything. It just does it by itself. You feel damp. This is not very good. I think I might need to find some place that... Oh, it's just like a regular elk or something. Alright. Yeah, being wet can be rather dangerous in this game. So maybe we seem to be coming up to a town. Maybe we should stop there and get inside and warm up a bit and dry off. Of course, now the thunderstorm is letting up. Hello, guard. This is probably someone's house. Yeah, that's somebody's house. There's some ore. That would be stealing, okay. There's a... Is this a stone quarry? Huh, that's weird. Oh look, we're already drying off. H hello? Dragons breathing fire in the sky. Vampires brazenly attacking people on the street. It's the end of the world, I tell you. Um... Make quite possibly be this is this another house that's somebody's house there's a blacksmith over here okay I'm not really in the mood for buying and selling though is this a mine maybe we can go in the mine out with it um right I want to go in the mine Oh, great. 
right, and there are lots of spiders in here. Um. All right, I can kill some spiders. You know what, actually? <laughs> I'm going to switch to Animus. Maybe I can catch some drag- some- I wish dragon souls. Some souls for enchanting. I thought there was another live one. Alright, I really hope these bridges don't break. I just don't feel very safe on here. Will I be able to shoot past the rope? Yeah, get a little higher for me, please. Uh, creepy spiders, not a fan. Aha! <laughs> that was kind of awesome. Alright, looting all the... Okay. Um, you know what? I have spells for occasions like this. I have Mage Light. And I think if I can remember how to use the Jackson Light, please, I might be able to just cast Mage Light all over the place. Don't want any carrots. This mine just looks like it's kind of fallen. Oh my. Oh my. It's. Uh, fallen into disrepair and disuse. Before we go down anymore, is there anything even over there worth? looking at? What's the... Uh, I don't... Uh, I don't want to know what that is. Okay. Um... I'm gonna cast Muffle. Nice. Illusion increased. Quite a bit, I might add. Sweet. Sneak increase as well. We are well on our way to level 24. I'm kind of impressed. I was hoping we might be able to get some ore from this, but it seems more likely not. Ooh, that... That yellowish... Whatever does not bode well either. Iron door. Okay, so there. Oh, nice. Thank you. There are some ore veins that I can mine. Nice. You're not allowed to hum. Gosh, that was freaky. Okay. Um. I don't know if I should. The, this. Well, the yellowish air doesn't seem to be hurting me. But something tells me I don't want to stay down here too long. I'm just gonna mine this ore, and then go. So, there were just a couple ore veins which I mined, and now there are no more spiders, so you should be thanking me. It's getting kinda late. It's almost 8 o'clock p.m. 
maybe we should find some place to rest. If there, you know, is some place. I'll have you know I can haul up just as much iron as you in a day, and still manage to clean up my messes. Think so, huh? Maybe you'd like to put some septums behind that boast. You have yourself a bet. Okay, so they can have fun with Welcome that. Welcome to Shore Stone. Thank you so much. Would you happen to be headed towards Darkwater Crossing? Um... Why would I go to Darkwater Crossing? My parents live there. I usually make the journey to bring them gifts and to just say hello, but I haven't been well lately. I've written some letters and placed them in a satchel. Perhaps you wouldn't mind delivering it to them on my behalf? Um, sure, I can deliver it. I can't promise that I'll go there right away, though. You would? Well, then, I would insist on rewarding you for your time. All right, Here, now we're talking. Take my satchel and give it to my father, Werner. He'll likely have something for you to bring back. Okay. So, what's wrong? I had a bad fall in the mine when I was bringing some food to the men. I was pretty bad off for a while. But a priest of Mara was passing through on his way to Dawnstar and healed me to the best of his abilities. I'm still pretty sore and I can't really walk too far without having to rest for a while. I'm really sorry to hear that. Can you tell me a bit about the mine? I might be a woman, but I can crack rock with the best of them. Be careful in there. You can take a nasty spill. Okay. Darkwater Crossing is a difficult journey. Mind yourself. Well, I managed not to die in the mine. So consider that an accomplishment. I'm kind of surprised she didn't say anything about the spiders. Okay, so they're hanging out there. I don't think this place even has, like, a tavern where I could stay for the night. So, a haze envelops the surrounding pines. Let's see how much farther we can get. I'm going to turn on Night Eye. And now it's, you know, ridiculously bright. We can continue on our journey west-ish. Yeah, we'll want to turn a hard left very soon. Kind of leave the road. Because where's the fun in riding on the road? You know what? It's too bright. We're in that, like, weird twilight, and there's this mist. Huh, there's a clearing over here. Might there be a locked container that we can open? Let's see... You know what? I'm thinking maybe I want to avoid bothering the beings here. We can kind of go around. Oh, and we aggravated them anyway. Alright. If I can get off my horse. Oh. What have we got here? Apparently I have thunderbolts. Oh, no, no, no. It's not Thunderbolt. I don't know what my swords look like. I don't remember what I had next. Oh gosh, oh gosh. You see, I was thinking. I shouldn't have been thinking this. I was thinking, oh no, they're all swarming Ar Arendor. And now they're all swarming me. Oh gosh. Alright, I am going to take some healing potions. Again, you know what? I'll try and fortify health. And I'm also. I think if there's ever a time to cast Stone Flesh, this is it. Yeah. I probably should have cast Stone Flesh before. 
healing please okay that didn't help me as much as I would like so I'm going to use more of my healing potion I'm not sure what that did um I want to do vigorous vigorous healing let's take some more I can drink like 20 potions why not am I sneaking please tell me I'm not sneaking What am I doing? Why? No, wait, no, wait, no. Oh god. This is bad. Okay, I didn't drop my sword. Oh no. Oh gosh. Why am I dying so much? This is really bad. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna conjure. At Tanakh. I don't like big bears. Like, send everything flying. You. Huh. Stop resisting in my vicinity. I don't like any of you. All I did was try to ride by and not bother you. This is insane. That was probably not the spell I should do. Would you like some healing, my friend? I hope you're not expecting a thank you. No, I'm not expecting a thank you. I wouldn't mind some idea of how much health Watch you it. have. Okay, you're at full health. I'm at full health too. Alright, sorry about that. <laughs> Let's get another play match or not. And... Can I cast Candlelight? I wonder. Okay. And I will put back... Thunderbolt. Here, he's going off to fight another battle. Okay. So I am going to do some looting and I want to actually explore this clearing or whatever it is that I almost got myself killed by getting so too close to. Like, what is over here? Father of the Nibbin. All right. I don't really see anything special in this place, and I do not see any locked containers. 
I'm very disappointed. We'll take a look at Arondor. Thank you very much for watching. Please subscribe if you have not already. Give the video a like if you enjoyed it. I always appreciate your comments. And also please share if you have friends who you think would enjoy this. Thank you once again and I hope you have an absolutely fantastic day.